Man, this is the best fragrance I've ever smelled. Like what on earth? Insanity. All right, boys. Today we're talking about my top 10 favorite fragrances to smell on a man. So these are gonna be my own personal choices that I absolutely go crazy for. If you wear these fragrances around me, things are, are starting to happen. Like, uh, I don't know, the, the walls are melting. I, I, I lost my underwears and I, I don't know. I don't know. I just don't know. My nipples get hard. No. <laughs> so if you're interested in hearing my choices, stay tuned and cue the music. Coming in at number 10, we have Jean Paul Gaultier La Malle Le Parfum. And let me just tell you the spiel on this fragrance. Oh, baby, baby. Spicy vanilla with iris and lavender. So sexy and smooth and definitely my favorite from the line. Of course, you're getting this La Malle DNA in there, but this is more elevated. Like you're driving a Honda Civic and then you're upgraded to a freaking Mercedes with leather interior. This just smells like a guy who has a way with women. He knows how to dress. He knows how to carry himself. He's a smooth operator. Sweet, cozy, romantic, and the dry down is absolutely magical. So um, if you end up spending the night, she's going to be smelling these on her sheets the next day and she'll be thinking about you the entire day. This is also very long lasting and the projection is moderate, enough to get you through the night with a nice scent bubble. Now we're talking about a fragrance that you guys know I freaking love so freaking much. I talked about this so many times on my channel. Get used to it because it will be here for long. Okay, this is Terre d'Hermes by Hermes. One of the best citrus vetiver fragrances I've ever smelled in my life. And to me, this is professional sex in a bottle. Like this is for a guy who goes to work, but doesn't only want to appear professional and sophisticated and, you know, preppy. He wants to throw a little bit of a spice underneath, like a sexiness. And it's like, hey baby, we're here at work, but you know, you know, that's the guy. This smells fresh, woody, and very masculine with some nice citrus, spices, and a lot of vetiver. A little bit mature, but don't let that scare you off. I repeat, do not let that scare you off. A lot of men think that these will be appreciated only by older women, but no, I've witnessed it with my own eyes. Younger girls complimenting this fragrance. I'm telling you, don't just spray this on a test strip and stick it up your nose like this. Wear it, put it on and let it do its thing in the air because the central of this is intoxicating. Like we're talking straight up daddy status. And you guys know I like me a good daddy scent. Performance is in beast mode, but it's enough to get your secretary out of work to do a little bit of extra photocopying in the back room. Definitely check this one out. At number eight, we have Maison Margiela's Just Club. This is so good. <laughs> Boozy, vanilla, tobacco, with a little bit of a creaminess. And I also get a slight coconut in there, which is very attractive. This is a DNA that is super loved by women to the point that they cannot resist but wear it themselves as well. So guys, if you wear this fragrance, I guarantee you a compliment. You're going to smell like a fun, outgoing guy who maybe likes to sip on some fine spirits. I also get a bit of a bad boy and mysteriousness in there, which is not like bad boy leather jacket, rough and rugged, but more like tamed and seductive and sexy. This is going to be perfect for dates or if you're in a close environment like a bar, because the performance is not amazing, but this fragrance is gonna make her wanna get closer to you and stay there. Highly recommend this if you don't have it in your collection yet. At number seven, we have my absolute favorite designer blue fragrance, and it is Chanel's Bleu de Chanel, right here. I personally prefer the EDT version, but Parfum or Eau de Parfum are great as well. You know, everybody has their preferences. Some people go with Sauvage, some other people go with YSL. I go with Chanel when it comes to blue fragrance. I absolutely adore this fragrance. I've complimented every single person that wore this fragrance, whether it was an Uber driver, 
a friend or a stranger in the streets. There is not a single woman out there, at least that I know of, that doesn't like this DNA and this fragrance. You're gonna smell fresh out the shower, masculine, crisp, and absolutely sexy. This is the fragrance that you can wear anytime, whether it's casual, in the office, or even go for a date. I wouldn't freaking mind smelling you like with this fragrance if you came on a date with me. I'm sure most of you out there own this fragrance, but if you are that 1% of people that watch me right now and you do not have this in your collection, stop what you're doing, honey. Stop what you're doing and go order this fragrance right now. Obviously, the EDT doesn't perform as good as the Parfum or the Eau de Parfum, but you know what? Just freaking overspray yourself with this and you're good to go. All right, guys, before we move on, I just wanna let you know that all of the fragrances on this video can be found at jomashop.com. If you don't know who they are, they're one of the largest sellers of watches in the world, but they've been growing in the fragrance category like crazy lately. They sell over 650 of the world's most iconic brands at discounted prices, and they're always adding new fragrance brands and products to the site. You can find a lot of niche fragrances, Middle Eastern fragrances, designer fragrances, and more, so there's a ton of variety. Shipping for fragrances is US only. However, if you buy anything else from their website, they ship to over 150 countries. And of course, I'm hooking you guys up with a little coupon code and you can use the code CURLY10 for an extra $10 off your order of 160 or more. All links will be in the description box below, so make sure you check them out. You see this fragrance right here? Well, once upon a time, I really did not like this fragrance. And I'm like, why does everybody go nuts for it? But you know what? It grew on me so much that I'm obsessed with it. This is Inicios, good for greatness. Man, this is freaking crazy. This is for my men who want to smell like Dubai royalty. Like you spray this on and women will automatically think that you have a lot of money in your pockets. Saffron, spices, oud, musk. You're gonna smell rich, elegant, bougie, and you're gonna stand out like a sore thumb, but in the best way possible. Let me just give you a picture on the performance of this fragrance. Imagine you wore this February 1st. It's gonna last until March 1st, bitch. <laughs> Enormous beast mode. You want beast mode fragrance? Get this. It won't disappoint you. You'll become a beast, okay? <laughs> on steroids. Here's the thing all eyes, all attention will be on you as soon as you enter the room. So if you don't like this and that's not your vibe, definitely avoid this fragrance. But if you do get it, you'll probably be the best smelling guy in the room. By the way, guys, if you're watching this and you haven't subscribed yet, what are you doing with your life? Hit that subscribe button, subscribe button, okay? So you never miss any video from me again. All right, let's move on. Thank you. Right at number five, we have one of my favorite fragrances from the house of Parfum de Marly, and it's none other than Sedley. Now, this fragrance, makes me so happy and horny at the same time. I don't know how they did this, but they created such a fresh fragrance that's also crazy seductive. Citrus, mint, woodiness, muskiness, such an invigorating and uplifting scent that you can wear in the spring and summer like there's no tomorrow. Again, this is such a versatile fragrance and in the dry down, you get this amazing creamy muskiness that women go nuts for it. Like when I'm saying nuts, I mean, how can I say this? My brain just shut off just by thinking about it. Absolutely sensual. And when the girls get a whiff of this stuff, they're gonna follow you to the next city. If you're looking for a fresh fragrance that has phenomenal performance, you need this bottle right now. You guys? have given me a lot of shit about this next fragrance. I've read so many of your comments telling me how terrible this smells, but you know what? This is my list of my favorite fragrances, and this one happens to be the epitome of sexiness for me. So you're gonna keep seeing this fragrance called Fahrenheit by Dior until the end of time. Now, let me get this clear. This is the EDT version. I'm not talking about Le Parfum business here. Uh, no, 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 no. We're not doing this. EDT is the best Fahrenheit you can get, period. This is freaking sexy leather gasoline. Oh my God. It's, it, you're, 
I'm yours. You're wearing this fragrance, I'm yours, baby. End of story. Nothing smells like this fragrance. Super unique, crazy. This is crazy stuff right here. Like I can't even put the words to explain how amazing this is. Now listen, I know that not every woman out there will love this fragrance as much as I do, but trust me, there is an audience for it. And I am the leader of this audience. There are women like myself that we don't want the men to smell like bubble gum, and sweet, you know, you know what I'm saying, the things that they are in the market right now. We want the guy to smell like he just went to put petroleum into his car and accidentally bathe in it. Honey! <laughs> <laughs> I had a friend in college who wore Fahrenheit and I witnessed myself a girl telling him he smelled delicious. You might think that this smells disgusting, but I'm telling you there's women out there that until this day, they truly... <laughs> Pull their tits for it. If you're a real man and you're watching these, Fahrenheit, EDT, now. Put it in the cart. At number three, we have YSL La Nuit de l'Homme Eau de Parfum. And this is exactly how I want my man to smell on a date. This is the flanker that made me completely erase the original La Nuit de Lhomme from my brain. You don't need it anymore. Take that original beautiful DNA of cardamom and lavender, add some tonka, leather, sandalwood, and coconut, and you have my personal date night king. When you wear these, you're gonna smell warm, inviting, and straight up irresistible. Definitely going to be a big compliment getter, but if you don't wanna hear it from me, at least hear it from other women as well. I'll give uh, La Nuit de l'Homme de Parfum a nine. Wow. This one is more like going out. If I see you walking by, I'll be like, this, smells, this guy smells good. Elevated, uh, wow. fancy. This is perfect when you're taking a girl out on a date for intimate settings that suddenly out of the blue ended up being um, a Netflix and chill. <laughs> if you trust my taste, get this and let it work its magic. At the number two spot, we have probably one of the strongest and sexiest fragrances I've ever smelled in my life. It is none other than Savage Elixir. One spray for that, no more. Yes, daddy. I gotta say, I've never liked the original Savage. Please don't kill me in the comments. But when the elixir came out, oh my God, like I regained faith. Fresh, sweet, spicy, woody, masculine, musky. This is a powerhouse. They took the Savage DNA that all the women go goo goo gaga for, threw in some of your dad's 80s cologne in there and somehow they made it modern and super, super sexy. To me, this is Savage for men, not boys. If you're under 25 years old, I wouldn't recommend this. But if you're above 25 years old, you know? Mm? As I said earlier, the performance on this fragrance is mega best, mega beast, excuse me. So be careful on the trigger so we don't, you know, suffocate or you don't send some people to the hospital for an inhaler. <laughs> Man, this is the best fragrance I've ever smelled. Like what on earth? Insanity. At number one, as you can see right here, hold on, let me get the strip here so I can spray it at one more time. We have Sergio Boise by Mancera. <laughs> I wanna cry. <laughs> this fragrance has been my favorite for years. I've never smelled something so ridiculously amazing before in my life. Citrusy, vanilla, musky, deliciousness in a bottle. I think if I had to choose one fragrance to smell on a man for the rest of my life, I want this one. Cedra Boise checks every single box for me. It is sexy, very attractive, comforting, very versatile. It has enough punch that it, you can even wear it in the winter. It literally awakens every single cell in my body. I don't know what else to tell you guys. This is easy wear, easy, easy compliments, Women absolutely adore this fragrance. Performance is great, but if you want something that lasts even longer, go for the intense version. But personally, this is it for me. Don't speak to me until you have this in your collection. When you do, then we can talk again. So there you have it, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to subscribe, give this video a big thumbs up and leave a comment down below letting me know if you've tried any of these fragrances or what is your favorite fragrance to wear. See you on the next one.